What is up guys, today is Saturday, March 26th, 2022, and today we have a bit of a different video. This is a fun, quote-unquote, curiosity kind of video, and um, there are some videos like this on YouTube out there, but I did want to make one myself, and today is the big question of what's inside a relic card. So, I found a relic card somewhere in my drawer, and um, this is not one that is of too much value, so this is a Darren McFadden jersey card from 2008 Playoff Absolute Memorabilia Football, and this is a Rookie Premier Materials unnumbered base jersey, um, which encloses a piece of a worn item from the 2008 NFL Rookies Player Premier. So this is not really more than a dollar or two at most, if anything. And uh, I'm going to show you guys what's inside of this relic card. So the way that relic cards are made are that the jerseys are cut up into flat big pieces and then they're put on a sticky sheet and then the sheets are chopped vertically into squares they have an alignment and uh, Panini does have a video on how jersey cards are made so if you guys do want to watch that that is probably the better video to watch and um so essentially what a little chunk would be is a cut piece of jersey that is on a sticky piece of tape and then they will layer it within the relic card and relic cards are thick because there are multiple layers and the top layer is a is the outer layer with a sheet that is printed on with all the foiling and everything and it is missing a chunk which is a window for the relic itself so let's dig into it so i mean i'm not really sure how to go by this i'll just see if i can dig throughout the side um so if you just if you just pick the window you could probably dig out a good chunk right there as you guys can see And this is more of like a fun little video because a lot of people don't actually see or ever ever get to know what's behind a relic card. And so we just took off the top layer right there and take off more of the top layer there. And then the second layer is the layer in which is the thickest layer of the card. And you guys can see that that is the main window for the jersey. And then we could probably even take the jersey piece out. So if we just push the back there and then dig and you guys can see that it is glued on so they actually have text on the back so they know that the jersey piece is from a specific player and they'll id the jersey as well probably as like an inventory code and that right there is what is inside a jersey card so pretty neat you didn't have to destroy the entire card down the middle. You can just dig out the window, the jersey in the window. And it's like, it's a pretty neat little piece right there. And this is like two things. It's a two-sided tape, one with text, and then the jersey stuck on. So that's pretty neat. I think I'll just, I'm not really sure where I'll put it. I think I'll just put the jersey piece inside here. This little bag. Cool. And that is our... Um, penny sleeve jersey card. So yeah, thanks for watching guys. Um, this was an interesting video, hopefully. Um, nothing against the player or the card or anything, but it was just, uh, I just thought of doing this kind of video. And so yeah, hopefully I will make some more videos in the future. I do have some early 97 boxes coming in, as well as a Topps UEFA Champions League first edition box for this upcoming release. Um, that's coming from Topps Germany, and uh, unfortunately it didn't come earlier this week, so I wasn't able to make an opening today. But next week, you guys will definitely get some sort of opening video. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching, guys, and stay safe.